Hey, welcome back, everybody. Sign here again with another episode on Scorched, and uh, we're at the uh, entrance to the ruins of Nasty. And I think it unloaded the cave. But, uh, yeah, well, on the map, you know, way down here, it's kind of hard to miss. You're just looking for basically an old church with the, uh, the roof blown out of it. And you can land your, your bird inside of here, whatever you come down here with. But obviously it's a cave, you can't... I just realized I have all of my... <laughs> my army on me still. And there is a uh, instant death pit in here. So it would really be a shame if I uh, raised up my entire army just to lose them in here. Alright. And... Yep, definitely old sunken city. Yeah, according to the lore, the city was too successful, and the obelisk decided that, you know, hey, no, you're not being challenged enough, so we're just going to make everything go sink into the desert. And... Yeah. <laughs> That's where we're at. I don't remember if they actually worshipped the manticore or not. I don't think they did. But... You don't have to worship something just to, you know, have art of it. Alright, so pathway splits. Let's take the right path. The left path, I believe, has more jumps to it. Across, you know, instant pit, you know, death pit. If you can get behind their head, they can't spit on you. Alright. It's actually nice to see a cave on Scorched where the, you know, everything spawns in at first. Instead of waiting until you're on your way out. Alright, well, I mean, that worked out. Huh. Oh, missed. Oh, yep, I see Arthros. All right, anybody else around here? And... Frickin' rubble golem, really? It hit for five damage. Okay. Ow. That hit for 74, okay. Ow. Dang it. This guy's got some knockback, which is a pain.
And there we go. All right, so can we have a look again now without something deciding it has an issue with my existence? So yeah, I need to get over there. And I still have jumps to do. Dang it. Okay, nope. No walk around first person while on the back of a wrap right there. Okay. Yeah, I know I just reload this thing. I must have put it away before it finished. Alright, it's gonna have some water. Go figure I shoot the high level one first. What is that one? Besides it's almost impossible to hit. Oh my god, really? Level 15, okay, that was not... Level 20. How the hell did that level 15 survive a hit, though? Hey! Come here. Oh, look, he's gonna go run into the cliff. Or off the cliff. They can use tools, but they ain't that smart. Uh, anybody else over there? That's where the artifact is, is right there. And... Yeah, no, I think we're good. I just gotta make this last jump now. Uh, here, do that. Um, we'll drop all this. I just saw something. Hey. Oh, there's a couple of them. This could be bad if they actually jump at me. Oh, they made to jump. That one didn't. <laughs> Alright. Wow. thing had two whips and a club. Wait, what I could do is just... Yeah, let's take the, uh, the safe option here. Okay, we got more bats, we got snails. All right. Moving on. It's usually a rubble, go rubble golem around here somewhere, isn't there? I know I've been cornered in here by one before. Alright, so Artifact of the Destroyer and the Scorched Sword Skin. Which... It's a bit out of scale for my character, but, you know... Looks pretty cool. And now from here, hmm, Arthur's. Oh, and right there too. Great. OK. 
Okay, that's your tail, so your head's behind the rocks, okay. Okay, not those ones didn't care. There's one. Oh, and another Arthro, okay. Really, you can't make that jump? You know what? Shotgun. Oh man, you hit the snail. How cruel can you be? Oh yeah, this is kind of dead end up here, isn't it? Hello, snake. Alright, so... I could have sworn there was an alternate path back this way. <laughs> yeah, looks like it right there, okay. Doo 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 doo. Doo doo. Yep. And we completely bypassed the jumping puzzle on the way back. So. Alright, man, just come here. No. Oh, hi. Lots of spitty. Oh, you're alive. Would have kept going, but this thing caught my uh, curiosity. Hmm, okay, it's a couple of blueprints. At least it doesn't weigh a whole lot. And let's see. Hey, bats. Later. Remember what I was saying about it's nice to have all the creatures spawn in first. Yeah, no. <laughs> Hi. Oh, I just got spit on. Okay. Lost my gloves. But yeah, there's literally, uh, there's no reason to fight Troy out of this cave. Just get something quick and just run past everything. Especially with the amount of Arthros there, you're going to lose your armor and your mount's going to take a bunch of stupid damage from the recoil. You just don't need to worry about it. So what do you have on you? Eh, nothing. And that's the last cave. Ooh, there it goes. And let's see. I mean, I guess head back to base. Really is a beautiful map, though, isn't it? It's just a shame there's so little to do over here. I mean, there's only three caves, there's. A few new creatures, but a lot of the regular, you know, creatures from the island don't spawn here. I mean, there's a bunch of explorer notes to find, but once you found those, it's like, okay, well, now what? Yeah, it just... I don't know. The Scorch just doesn't feel as, like, in-depth as, you know, the island or... Extinction. Uh, Aberration is kind of the same way, though, too. It's once you've gotten yourself set up, like 90% of the map is done, really. Hey. Hey. Hi. Are you any good? Okay, for some reason I can't see your level, but... I'm just getting out of a spyglass in my hotbar. 85. Not that great. You know what?
Hey, Rex. Go down. I kind of like my shotgun. Alright, and... Yeah, it's just like there's so little to do over here. It's kind of a shame. Alright, so we're over here at Green Ob, and I decided to have a little bit of fun. <laughs> I set up some minigun turrets over here. Alright, um, options. Uh, let's go to high range. And... Oh, I didn't hit accept on the one, did I? I did not. Except, there we go. And unfortunately, they automatically target fish. So it's a good thing I brought over a lot of ammo. At this point, I've got resources to burn. And these things, uh, they, they take the advanced sniper bullets, but they're quiet too, I mean. And they're, yeah, <laughs> they're insanely fast when it comes to killing things. Uh, but yeah, usually, we're over at Green Knob, you know, obviously. Uh, it's usually pretty bad around here for uh, Capros, so I just wanted to make sure <laughs> that nothing was going to bother my army. Uh, actually, we should probably get to uh, Wyverns first. Here we go. Ow, oh, freaking super heat, really? There we go. Uh, it's like really just a horrible, horrible puzzle we have to do here. To get everybody in as much as we can. Alright. And... There we go. Get yourself some food. What are you stuck on? Are tails really that much of an issue for you guys? Apparently, yeah. Um, great. How many wyverns are left? Two. Okay. Ah, uh, man. Wyverns. Man, these guys can never play Twister. Okay, I should be good enough there. And then I have my lightning, which is what I was going to be riding on. I don't know if we're going to be able to get him in or not, though. Uh, yeah, 15k health. You got a lot of points dumped in. You know what? No. Come on. There we go. How many RGs I got left now? Uh, two. Okay. Alright, come on. Can I choke it in here? Uh, can you fit in here? Yeah, there we go.
Okay, cool. I can access the terminal still. That's what I wanted to know. Because I can get in and out by going underneath the wyverns, but... Uh, so it looks like we have eight wyverns, ten RGs, and most likely a microraptor coming in with me. Because I keep forgetting it's on my shoulder. How many levels have you gotten now? Oh, there's 16. Okay. And a point of health, right? I'm surprised you guys haven't gotten shot yet. Major Berry. Raw Prime Fish. You are greedy on this map. Alright. So, next episode, uh, Manticore Fight, obviously, right? I just need to... Oh, I can get right up in here. Except for I'm accessing the Wyvern on this side. Okay. Alright, I'm going to need three artifacts and 20 of each talon, which, well, we've got. I forgot to drop off a destroyer while I was over at the base. Oh well. Not a huge deal. Uh, something else I did is I went ahead and made some medical brews, accidentally drank one, and I made up some, well, I call them Serpies, but they're uh, basically just a custom recipe. 85 water, though. And, uh, yeah, it should help quite a bit. Between that and the uh, the cooked mutton, I think we'll be doing okay. But uh, these things are better than canteens on Scorched, so... <laughs> these don't evaporate. <laughs> Mini guns are just killing fish left and right. It's awesome. But, thank you for coming out. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and until the next one, this is Science signing out. Have fun.